Hello. Hi. Good day. How are you? How are you doing? How are you coping with this lockdown of the nationwide? Everybody should stay indoor. Yeah. Have they said it to your country too? That you should stay indoor <laughs> because of the coronavirus? Yeah. It's not uh, funny. For those of us with kids, no school, nothing, just stay home. <laughs> it's not that easy. It's not easy when you have kids to just stay in the house 24 hours. You have to keep them busy. So thanks to God for the school in uh, the country where we live. They did their best to organize a whole line school. And for the young kid children they brought their things they were supposed to teach them at home to keep them busy so they don't miss anything and, and that is very good and that's what we are doing i just want to share a video how i i am doing all these things <laughs> oh i start my day yeah so awesome please i know you hear it in the other part of this video Take your time to pray, intercede for the nation, intercede for the doctors, the law, the, the nurses, the victims of this coronavirus, please, and please be safe. I know it's not easy if you're like me, sitting down at home is not our thing that we just have to do. And that's why you can do what you know how to do best to keep you busy i'm actually sitting down on the step <laughs> yeah i'm sitting on the step because the kids are downstairs i just asked them please give me a few minutes so i hope you enjoy the remaining part of this video i will see you at the end of it subscribe to this channel if you have not and uh, stay positive stay positive I do it because I want to just lose some kilo and I look good whenever I did sport I feel good I have more energy I'm a, <laughs> I'm a lazy African woman but I, I really need the energy to deal with my day and um, look good I have some weak points my belly don't want to see it and this shoulder here yeah, is just too wide and uh, I'm okay. I can fit on my clothes very well. I just want to look good for myself. It's very important to be healthy. But my day always starts with rough sort of reality. I don't have the hard copy that I have online where I always um, share the rough sort of reality in our channel and to everyone. And then I feed the kids some breakfast clean up the mess for Bye. the kids can uh, drive you crazy really so i have my hard copy of absolute reality here i don't know if you can actually see it it's so bright it's actually very difficult to see <laughs> yeah that is it my hard copy of my absolute reality and um, that's why i read it and today was activating the treasure in you and can I read it with you? It says in Second Corinthians chapter four verse seven. It says we have this treasure in heavenly vessels, that the excellence of the power might be of God and not of us. So if you have not read your absolute reality, please do. This uh, this is just the way. And at the end of today, with everything I'm doing, I will go after the kids are in bed because I still have to teach my son some things from school they already bought what they are supposed to learn for this week so i have to be doing it every day keeping busy pick them outside if it's possible to play but they actually they can play at the back of the house and feast dinner play a little bit watch tv at the end of the day then i go study my bible 
So it's, it has been wonderful stay home. I'm gonna say I don't like it. Staying home in this coronavirus, please everyone put it to your prayers. Pray for the nurses, the doctors, the country that are affected and people who are sick now in the hospital. Please put them in your prayers. Let's make your mother power available. I hope you like this video. If you want to see more in this uh, lockdown, let me know. See you guys. Bye. As I was saying, as I was saying, for the car came to distract. Yeah, you have to wash the kids, huh? It's so cute. Ah, it's actually very beautiful. Yeah, as I was saying, God has been faithful. Whatever it is that is happening in the world cannot stop us. We are not going to talk our fear. We are going to talk the word. So I'm encouraging every one of you to speak the word of God concerning the situation. Concerning the chaos. Don't talk your fear. Talk your faith. Speak your faith. Let your faith be held in whatever it is. He said, if we Christians don't talk our faith, if we are talking our fear, what do we expect the unbeliever to say? Speak your faith. Don't let whatever is happening around you to say something else. Let your faith prevail. That word that you'll be keeping inside of you, that you'll be hearing, it's time for you to pour it out. Spend your time to pray for heavy doctors, nurses, who are putting their life on line, helping those people that are contacted with this virus. Begin to pray for them. And those who are lying down in the hospital bed, begin to speak God's word concerning their life. The faith will stir up in them to receive their healing. So by faith, faith in the word of God will make you hold. Anytime I listen to the healing school promo, and you hear those people after hearing those words of faith for months, for weeks, their faith, you see, that I was ready. I just know I will not leave the same way I came. So that faith those people have make the whole. We pray that those ones now that are infected with this disease, that their faith will stir up to get healed for whatever it is. I'm already at the back. As you can see, I have to be careful to just wash the kids. I will hear you guys some other time. Hope you enjoyed this of my beautiful village. <laughs> Who have watched the video of three things I said I would never do. This is my village. But actually, it's a beautiful one. I won't change it for anything. Bye. Subscribe to Flourish Channel. God bless you. Ah, you are back. Did you watch it all? Did you see your girl pictures? How you was um, doing some sports? I sure do. Start my day with the Rhapsody of Reality. I don't know if I say that there, but that was how I start my day. 
reading God's word and then set the king children the breakfast and that is when I did the sports that I do yes I do the sport <laughs> and then take the work just like you saw it or the video when I was walking my little village yeah I will not trade this village for anything I'm grateful to God but I hope you enjoyed this video subscribe to this flourish channel share the video if you like it and there are more videos coming i have video really on my phones that i need to upload there's great things about the word of god that i've been putting that down and i will see you in my next video have a beautiful day god bless you bye keep flourishing